I'm Weston Manders, and welcome to this week's edition of Oglethorpe Arts. This Saturday the 19th, in the museum, we will be celebrating the launch of Charge Magazine, an online magazine started by some very fine Oglethorpe ladies who sure know what they're doing. Charge is a strong name as like taking control of your life, taking charge of your life. We're an online magazine that caters to 13 to 18 year old African American teens. Our magazine is really about empowering women. Empower the next generation. It's not strictly about, oh, how to look cute and paint your nails is pretty color. Everybody can read this magazine. We want to cover a, a range of things. Fashion to education, beauty, like real world applications. I'm really excited. I'm, I'm a little nervous, but I'm totally excited. And I think it's going to be a hit. It's not a problem to be who you are, so take charge of that. Also, The Love Letters is making its world premiere this Saturday at 7 and, and Sunday at 5.30 on the Conan stage, written by our very own Tatiana Randolph. The Love Letters is a production that's set in 1927. I, I guess I just incorporated a lot of the African-American jazz era concepts that I grew up on. Dorothy Dandridge, Duke Ellington, and people of that sort, but then also incorporating that modern feel for the youngins and then the yeah. 1927s for the dusties is what I like. Don't forget to sign up for Campus Movie Fest. Time is running out. Now for this week's Oglethorpe Artist in the Spotlight. So, what's your name? My name is Weston Manders. Uh, I'm uh, 21 years old. I graduated at Oglethorpe uh, in August of 2012. Uh, and I'm, I'm loving life. Do you feel at home on the stage? I love it when you walk into a, onto a stage, completely black, you can't see the audience, they can't see you, no lights, and then you just start hearing a, a drip, drip, drip. What is it? What, what is that? What, everybody in the audience is just going, huh? And you're on stage going, it's a faucet! Do you have any interesting stories to share with us? And the importance of being earnest, it's funny now to think about it, but we used a live iguana to play Algernon, and you know, it was, it was a choice. <laughs> it was a choice. So what are you doing now? I'm working at Georgia Ensemble Theater. I'm doing uh, a production of Swell Party. Ooh, yes, yes. It's a brand new play written by the talented Topher Payne. You know, Weston, you're a nice kid. You're a nice kid. Let's just be real. Can, can, we, can we get a little closer? We really did. We're not, we're not strangers. So where do you see yourself, Weston Manders, in 20 years? Oh, you're so charming. Um, 20 years, we're looking at, we're looking at a record deal. At boats, we're looking at, we're looking at designer jeans. In 20 years, I'm, I'll probably be Making dinosaur bones. We're looking at trucks on tops of trucks. We're looking at uh, blazers made out of old shoes. We're looking at uh, six nuns it, uh, on staff. Just, just to start. We'll see you next week.